Welcome to Byte Further. What I'll talk about today is how to fix iPhone 8 or iPhone 8 Plus touch screen not working. To fix the unresponsive screen problem, first you'll need to understand why your iPhone 8 touch screen is not responding to touch. If you have trouble with iPhone 8 touch screen not working properly all of a sudden while using, it could be a software issue. The screen is on but it doesn't respond when you tap, slide left or right, type or try any other gestures. Sometimes, the unresponsive touch screen on your iPhone 8 even won't let you slide to power device off or unlock it. The good news is that the software glitches that result in your iPhone 8 touch screen not responding can be easily fixed by a few steps we'll talk about later. Another reason why your iPhone 8 screen stops working could be an issue with the physical screen. The screen protector, the case and the loosened cable under the display all could cause your iPhone 8 screen not to respond to touch. Ok, without further ado, let's fix the iPhone 8 touch screen problems now. Most often, you should do a restart whenever the touch screen suddenly stops working or becomes unresponsive. If the screen doesn't respond when pressing the button or it won't let you slide to shut down, do an forced restart. It won't erase your device content. It just turns off your iPhone 8 then back on to make the screen responding to touch again. Here's how to do that. Quickly press the volume up button, quickly press volume down button, then keep pressing the power button on the right. The screen will turn black. You need to continue holding the power button until the Apple logo appears. This may take a few seconds. Now, Apple logo shows up. Release the button and then your iPhone 8 will boot up and should now respond to your touch inputs now. A bad update could also make iPhone 8 touch screen unresponsive. Some users complain that the screen isn't working consistently or it responds intermittently to touch after the iOS 14, iOS 15 update. If after the forced restart, the touch screen is still not working on your iPhone 8 or iPhone 8 Plus, then you should do an update with iTunes or Finder. Connect your iPhone 8 or iPhone 8 Plus to any computer and open iTunes or Finder. Don't worry if you can't enter the passcode on your not working touch screen to get the device recognized. You can put the device into recovery mode, then iTunes or Finder will detect your device without requiring any passcode to update it. To put your iPhone 8 or iPhone 8 Plus into recovery mode, press the volume up button once, the volume down button once, and then press and hold the side button screen turns black, Apple logo shows up and you still need to keep holding side button. When you see the connect to computer icon, let go of the side button and you're now in the recovery mode screen. Now, iTunes or Finder should quickly detect your iPhone 8 and give you two options, update or restore. To fix that iPhone 8 touch screen won't work without losing any data, choose update option to update your device to the latest version. This might take 2 or 3 hours to complete the update, so please wait patiently. Also, if your iPhone 8 exits recovery mode during the process, just repeat the steps to put it into recovery mode again. Once the update finishes, your iPhone 8 will restart and you see, the display is working now. If not, you'll need to put the device into recovery mode and then choose restore to factory reset the device. Note that you'll lose everything after the reset. It's advised to try the following steps before restoring your device. As mentioned earlier, the screen protector and your phone case could also stop the touch screen from working correctly on your iPhone 8. If you have any, remove them all from your device. First, the screen protector. Next, the phone case. Also, if you've connected the headphones and USB cable, disconnect them all. Then, use a clean and dried cloth to wipe clean your iPhone 8 screen. When you're sure that there's no hair, dust, water or any debris on the screen, force it to restart. Hope now your iPhone 8 is responding to your touch now. If not, your final step to fix the unresponsive iPhone 8 screen before going to Apple Store for help is to factory reset it via recovery mode. Back up everything important and then press the volume up button, volume down button and hold the side button until you get into recovery mode. Then. Click Restore to roll your iPhone 8 back to its original status. Sure, the Restore can fix all kinds of iPhone 8 display issues related to software. If the screen doesn't respond on iPhone 8, or the display is not working in some areas, for example, the left side of the touch screen is not responding when you type character A and Q after screen replacement or dropping on the ground or into water, set up a Genius Bar appointment at your nearest Apple Store ASAP to get it repaired. That's all the iPhone 8 touch screen not working fixes. If you like it, 
please give it a thumbs up, share it and comment below to let me know. To learn more tech tips about iPhones, subscribe to the Byte Further channel to stay tuned with us, or click another video to keep watching.